is up YouTube welcome back to another video in today's episode we have got a big order I've got two boxes but most of the stuff from Target that is a designer dupe is in today's video so I did a big big order as you can see we're gonna go through it um, I have a couple of trips coming up as you know I do travel a lot that's a lot of my other videos um, but I was looking for some stuff for the summer and I was scrolling through Target's website looking for some sandals, um, looking for some stuff for the pool actually. And I came across some stuff that is a pretty decent looking designer dupe. So I ordered a bunch of those items. I'm gonna give you the price. I will pop the descriptions up in the video and down below so you can find those links um, in case you are curious. I feel like not all of these are gonna be um, a knock out of the park. But obviously these items are around 20 to 30 dollars and they are dupes for like Dior, Hermes and those types of things. So stick around. You're not going to want to miss this. This is all the stuff we're going to offer spring and summer. Let's jump right in and show you. I've got eight items today, although there are more designer dupes out there on Target site. But without further ado, here we go. We're going to start with item number one. Okay, so first up um, are these slide sandals from Target. Obviously everything's from Target, I don't know why I said that. Um, but these are slide sandals that are styled after the ones you would find from Hermes. That They are gonna be that Hermes dupe. And don't come after me if I'm saying these names wrong. I am Hawaiian, I am not like saying things <laughs> in French or other, other like German and luckily there's none of that but you know my husband's in a car so my point being if I butcher something it is not intentional um, I'm doing my best but anyways this is a dupe for I had to look at my notes because I wrote down the names here this is called the Nina slide sandals in the color cognac from Target um, they of course have that little rubber bottom on there they are a dupe for the Hermes Oran sandals. So these cost 20 bucks. Um, the, obviously the ones you would buy from Hermes are anywhere like 600 and, or 600, 760 bucks on up um, all the way up to like over a thousand. So these were $20, they're in the color cognac. I will put all the links down below in case you're curious. Good little like pool slide, pool sandal. I did try these on. Um, these looked really good on. They were decently comfortable, um, good, good, solid, um, basic and staple for these. So um, these I think I will keep. I can't guarantee I'm going to want to keep everything, you know, but um, that is probably one of them that I will keep. All right. This is like the, the thing when I, when I saw this and, and the matching tote, I, it was like it screams Dior dupe. Um, this is, I ordered it, it comes in two colorways, but this is a Capri. They are the pool sandals in a destination style, but come on, obviously it is a call out with the Dior uh, slides that you will see. Um, this is, these were $24.99 they come in black and then they come in a white color, which I do have the white one that I'll show you. Um, the slide sandals, these are $24.99. Um, and obviously the dupe is the Dior slide sandals and they come in various colors depending on how, um, which one you buy, but obviously when you buy from Dior, they're like, what did I write down? They're $775. So these are $24.99, decent find. They seem, you know, like if you're going to wear these to the pool, which is what I'm going to be doing because I'm going to Vegas in two weeks um, with a girlfriend, that's what I'll be using them for. They, this, the black pair says Capri, um, and then the white pair, you can find it, the white pair has a different, says Saint Tropes on it. So it has obviously the different destination, um, but these are the only two colors they had. They had a black and they had this cream, $24.99 for these slides. And then the item, the next item that I have are the matching bags. Um, so do they look familiar? Do they look like the the Dior tote um, book bags. So that is, they obviously these match the sandals 
And um, I will admit, when I got this in the mail, I mean, I probably should have looked at dimensions, but I thought it would be bigger. So um, it is still a decent size. It was $30. What I do like about it is it does have a zip top closure on there. Um, so for this one, it has, so you won't, your stuff won't go disappearing or flying out of the bag. There is a zipper. There is a zipper compartment in there as well. Um, it does have that canvas lining, canvas feel, but this is a cute little $30 um, Dior dupe that matches the cream or white color sandals. And then the black version that matches the black sandals in Capri. It's the same size here, just, just in the different colorway. Exact same price, 30 bucks with the zipper. Um, I do actually really like the black one. I don't know if I'm gonna keep the, the white one, but um, it is it is still a decent dupe. So obviously when you buy a Dior small book tote, those are like three grand on up. I think 3,200 or something around there now. I would much rather pay $30, even though I do like myself some luxury handbags. Um, but if you're gonna be taking it to the pool, somewhere where it might get a little bit dirty, that would be my pick. So um, I, whoops, let me show you just together before I move on. There's your little matching matching set. So this one's definitely gonna be a keeper. I will be keeping that set. All right, up next are a couple of other items. And oh, because my kid was in this box because I found a little toy uh, deck in there. Um, I know that didn't come from Target. All right, so this next one that I found that was like, hmm, made me think. This is a $30 lime green padded bag from Target. It is a chain, it's a snap closure, and actually not a snap, it's a slide. So if you see that, you just slide that out and then pull it on open. Um, but padded bag, does this look like Bottega Veneta to you? Because that's giving me Bottega Veneta vibes. So in my notes here, this one is, of course, I'll pop the links down below. Um, but this one is the Sophie crossbody bag in lime green. The dupe, the closest thing on the current Bottega Veneta website that I could find was one of their cassette crossbodies, one of the padded ones. Those are like two to four thousand dollars. So this one is 30 bucks. The crossbody strap is detachable, um, so you can use it as a clutch instead. But there is your, let me snap it closed again and then I'll show you the inside. Um, but there is your little strap. It is pretty cute. It is a cute little evening going out bag. Um, but you, of course, you can shorten that up there um, and make it adjustable. It does have a back pocket right there for you. Um, and then on the inside, let me get all the, the tissue paper out. On the inside, it does have one little zippered pocket right there. Um, you could probably fit your phone, a lipstick, small wallet. That's probably what can fit in that bag. So lime green, it is pretty cute. It is soft. Um, I can't say how well it'll hold up to scratches and that kind of stuff, but, um, for 30 bucks, Hey, get some Bottega Veneta vibes. Although I know I, sometimes I'd much rather have the leather, the real leather, but cute bag nonetheless. I believe it did come in other colorways. I don't know if I saw them on the Target website, but I do know I saw them in store. I saw a different color. I think I saw blue and there was, um, oh, there was a denim version because denim, denim seems to be in again, right? So that was another item that I picked up. Now I do wear loafers for work a lot. Um, so I did, I was looking for I'm like so borderline to buying the pair of loafers from Gucci. Um, so I decided I would just try and look. I have a pair from Sam Edelman now that I really, really love, but they're getting like totally worn out. Um, but yeah, so I did pick up two items that reminded me of Gucci in the loafer style. These are gonna be the slides with that little um, horse fit design across the toes. These are, um, 
These are your Laurel Loafer Flats in black. So the dupe are like the Gucci Jordans. It's around about $1,000. These were $32.99. Now, obviously, they're not, maybe they won't be as, they're not, probably not going to be as comfortable. The leather, or not leather, but the, the whatever it's made of. But the edging does feel pretty stiff. Um, but I did, I did try these on. They do look good. We'll just kind of, we'll see how long they last. I probably will keep these. But again, they were $29.99, so um, this was the dupe. I will, of course, pop the links below, but this was a decent, a decent find on their website. Um, the other thing I did find, did I write it down? Please tell me I did, was I did pick up the regular pair of um, loafers. So these are... These, I think, were the same price. Oh, no, these were $32.99. And again, these are another dupe. Um, if you've seen the, the Gucci version, um, then you know that obviously this is a lot cheaper. Now, I did try these on. I may still end up buying the, the Gucci pair because the, the trim in the back of the heel here, it has a really sharp edge. So, in fact, I think it's going to definitely give me a blister. So... Um, yeah, so I don't, I don't think these will be, I don't think I'll be keeping these, um, but the little flat ones with the, that don't have the backing on them, I'll be, I'll be keeping those for sure. But if you're interested, these are a much cheaper option, um, than obviously buying the designer ones. Okay, we've got two more items to get through, and then that'll be the rest of my designer dupe haul from Target. Obviously there were more. There were some things that I was like, hmm, that looks like Prada um, on their website. So Target, Target was really getting their game together. Um, all right. So this next one is kind of, uh, it's gives me Chanel-esque vibes. Um, it is kind of like the Chanel lambskin capital ballerina flats in the two-tone. Um, it is like a beige color on the Target site. These are called the Junie Ballet Flats in Beige. Um, if you do look at the Chanel one, I'll put a picture somewhere on the screen. They do look very similar, although obviously not the same. These cost $22.99, um, but they are a decent closet staple if you're on a budget for that one. And the trim on these is fabric, so um, when I tried these on, the heel wasn't giving me any issues compared to the last pair of shoes that I just showed you. So those I picked up as well. I did need a pair of those for work. Um, and then this last item, okay, this last item, I kind of had to do a little bit of research just because I only know so much about the Hermes products as far as their handbags go. Um, but this one was a little bit of a dupe. And I have seen this one running around the internet. Um, and I also just thought it was really cute. I've been looking at the Strathberry bags. And so this one seemed like an interesting find that I wanted to pick up. So this is the Crocodile Print Mini Top Handle Crossbody. So you can either obviously carry it like this. Um, or there is a... Let me see if I can get this open. There is a crossbody strap for this one. Um, what I paid for this item from Target, I paid $35 for this one. And the dupe that it looks pretty close to is an Hermes Mini Kelly. And I don't need to tell you how much a Mini Kelly costs. Obviously it is not a Mini Kelly. Nothing's gonna be really close to a Mini Kelly without spending that much money. But if you're like the rest of us and you don't have one of those, you can't afford one of those, um, this seems like a sturdy little bag. Uh, the inside you do get, let me pull out the little papers in here. You do get three pockets. Um, there are three compartments in this bag. One of them does have a little zippered compartment. I don't know if you can see that, um, but it is cute nonetheless. The closure is a little, it's a hook closure um, with a little ring push on there. If I can actually get this closed, that would be nice. There you go. Um, but overall, back pocket, cute little bag for 30 bucks. I do really like the crocodile print. Again, I think there was a black one running around on, on the internet, but I couldn't find it. 
there I believe there are other colors because I did when I went into my local Target I saw it in a few other like matte um, colors although I didn't see this one in the store this one was online again I will put links hopefully they're not sold out in case you want any of these items but that is eight items from Target that really gave me the designer the designer vibes and so this is my designer dupe haul of course there are many many more items Target seems to really be off the hook with a lot of these things lately but are there any other designer dupes out there that you really like let me know down in the comments. I'm always looking for those items. I just thought I would share today. Um, I think I'm gonna be keeping a good chunk of this because I, I, I did like a lot of the items. So um, if you like this video, please hit that subscribe button. Follow me over on Instagram for more travel and fashion, luxury related content. As always, this is just a fun little thing for me. So I would love to see you in the next video. And please, please have a wonderful day and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.